subscribe to Wiley WS for making the intro. So anyway, let's begin the video. What's up, bro? Sons here and Dick Sons, and we are gonna be reacting to Disney is shutting down Blue Sky Studios by Veil Schemum 94. Now, if you guys don't know Blue Sky Studios, they're the people who made um the Ice Age franchise, um, um re the Rio franchise, including the the Angry Bird um slash Rio games. Um, what else they made? I believe they also made some other movies what else they made actually hold up let me let me check let me check real quick because I, I probably forgot all right spies in the skies which kind of shocked I actually never thought blue sky studios made that actually they also made robots which honestly that, that was a good movie but i never knew blue sky studios made that fred and ann never didn't watch never watched that yet horton here's a who never watched it in an epic which i believe that was a bad movie so i just didn't watch it so yeah they made a lot of good good slash bad movies over the years and yeah now now i don't remember much from some of their bad movies i just know they made some good movies and then some bad movies so yeah so yeah this is the end of an era because disney is like buying a lot of studios now so you know now they're shutting down some so Let's hope they don't buy DreamWorks next. I don't know. If Disney is buying Marvel, Star Wars, and then other franchises, they, they might buy D DreamWorks next. Who knows? So, yeah. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoy the video. Please subscribe with the bell on those gonna notify when I upload a new video. Do it. So, let's get to the video in 3, 2, 1. We have our cheese. Well, this is the end of an It really is. Guys, by the way, if you guys hear back... Age, robots, Rio, all of these animated movies, and many more, were brought to you by a production company called Blue Sky mm -hmm. Studios. Even if you haven't heard their name before, there's a near guarantee you grew up with their movies. Yeah, I did. Or at least knew they existed. I, I did. I, some of their movies, movies released, uh, you know, hit, I like. But they're all still memorable in one way or another. Now, despite the company's long like I, success... It's like Ice Age, considering some of their movies were, like, honestly good. Up, given the current economic realities, after much consideration, and evaluation, we have made the difficult decision to close filmmaking operations at Blue Sky Studios. The Blue Sky's library and IP will remain part of Disney, and there are no plans I hear for another major studio to absorb Blue Sky's employees and operations. A series based on Blue Sky's Ice Age characters is already in the works for Disney+. Plus. While it's sad to see the company disappear, what may be even sadder is the unfinished movie that we probably won't see. This is Nimona. It was gonna release in early 2022, and it was all about a shapeshift teaming up with a mad scientist with okay this looks like a, a good movie i'm not even gonna lie mm, from the poster or whatever the animation uh, honestly would look wonderful but i just want to know since they're shutting down are they also gonna put like all of blue sky studios movies like all the movies they ever made and then the ones they never made they're just gonna get i don't know cancel something are they gonna put also put those on Disney Plus or is it you know they're just gonna stay online so you can just watch it like on all Amazon on Amazon Prime or is like I please tell me they're gonna put it on Disney Plus because if they do then you know I'll watch some of them considering some of the newer um Ice Age movies I never saw and then and then I remember Rio one but I actually never remember Rio two because I believe that was a bad sequel and then you know I could watch some of the other movies like Ferdinand you know you know. You know, it would actually be good if they moved it to Disney Plus. It's just 10 months left in production. This was on the radar for animation fans, and now it's not coming. I'm not going to claim I was looking forward to this one because I knew very little about it, but imagine all the work that went into it. Animated movies are a bundle of love, sweat, and tears for many, and knowing that Nimona's team doesn't have the chance to get it out into the world, that's depressing. Blue Sky Studios has been around for several decades. Oh yeah, they also made a Peanuts. That was also a good movie. Good things need to end at some point in time, and the current state of the economy led to this decision. Right now, the only thing we can really do is cross our fingers for all the employees of the company who are suddenly out of a job. A lot of them have genuine talent when it comes to storytelling so hopefully they can find another job soon but yeah this is the end of blue sky i don't know what else to say it's just disappointing 
So anyways, that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please tell me what you guys think of the news. Honestly, it's sad because now, you know, they lost their jobs. But hey, hope they can work for, oh no, Disney, Cartoon Network, or Nickelodeon. So yeah. Uh, and I'm also hoping that they also put some of the movies on Disney Plus. Because if they do, this would probably be good for Disney Plus. And, you know, people who actually like Blue Sky Studios can actually watch the movies on Disney Plus and probably buy it. So yeah, since that was the video, if you guys enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the bell and I'm just gonna find one upload to anyone who has to do it. Since that was the video, I'll see you guys later. Bye, peace.